Boise State 19, Air Force 14. This is... This this was weird. I will say that. Um, there we go. Pull it up on the screen so you can see what we're looking at. Boise had to settle for field goals in this game. Uh, you look at the drive chart and... Da, 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 touchdown. So they had a punt on their first drive. And after that, Air Force fumbled the ball. Boise took it 63 yards in 13 plays and scored. Which, by the way, Boise with a, a good OC in Dirk Cutter and a mobile quarterback, it has completely changed this team. They are competent now. This is a good football team. Andy Avalos made a switch that he had absolutely had to make, and this team is better without Hank Bachmeyer. They just are. Touchdown on that second drive, and then field goal, field goal, field goal, field goal. I mean, just nuts. Uh, good first half, terrible second half for Boise, says Double O'Neal. Yeah, second half, um, you know, interception, punt, punt, half. But when your defense is playing that way, you don't really have to do a whole lot. They were up 19-7, to really, for the majority of the game, it felt like. Like, they, they took a, a big lead early and didn't have to do anything. So, I, I feel like they kind of sat on it a little bit. Um, they got the ball down to the Air Force 22, to the 34, to the 11, uh, to the 25, and, of course, the touchdown. So, and then they didn't cross midfield again in the second half. But they didn't have to. <laughs> they didn't have to do that. So, Air Force did score uh, in the fourth quarter and made it close. But, yeah, it, like you don't have a quick strike offense. Uh, Hazik Daniels, I believe, went out for a little bit in this game. Um, yeah, uh, Ben Britton came in, threw the ball one time. Uh, Britton didn't run the ball uh, a single time. So, they, they just, they're not the same team when they don't have Hazik Daniels out there. But uh, Daniels did come back in, 14 carries, 70 yards. He was 4 out of 8, passing 96 yards. Uh, but Taylor Green is the story here. Um, 16 carries for 24 yards. Or excuse, excuse me, 16 passes for 24 yards, 207. Uh, I don't even know what I just said. 16 out of 24 passing, 207 yards, and one pick. And uh, and he didn't have to really run all that much. Five carries, 16 yards, but the threat of him was was awesome. Uh, their rushers, uh, Jonty and Noah, were pretty good. You know, not bad. Uh, zone 6, Air Force is a disappointment this year. Yeah. Yeah. I've got a play on them over 7.5 and wins, and I took them on the BetUS show at over 8.5 wins, and I don't think I'm going to get there. Don't think I'm going to get there. Now, the schedule does ease up a little bit. Uh, now that I'm thinking about it. Let's see. Let's take a look at Air Force's schedule. Da -da -da. They have got Army. Could lose that. New Mexico, Colorado State, and they haven't beaten San Diego State in forever, it feels like. So, just something to pay attention to going forward. But yeah, uh, cheers to Boise State on a much-needed, big-time, big-time win. I mean, that was huge. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show. <laughs>